Hook curl zones are primarily used by the inside two zone defenders in a cover three. They're responsible for protecting the inside short and intermediate areas of the field, but can sometimes be responsible for short outside areas of the field as well. Notice how these hook curl zones respond to drags, slants, and in routes over the middle by slot receivers. Vertical hooks are primarily used by outside edge players in cover two or cover two zone blitz. Depending on the route combination, they may go man to man in the seam with a vertical route. Note here how we get the press and then DeMarcus Ware follows down the seam and forces the incomplete pass. Mid read zones are primarily found in Tampa 2. This will also happen if you playmaker a player in the middle of the field into a hook zone. They're responsible for reading the strength of the formation, which is the side with more receiving options, and will dop, drop for depth down the middle of the field to fill the area between the two safeties. The next type of hook is a three receiver hook. These are found primarily as the inside zone defender in a cover four, and can be also found in a cover three, also known as a fire zone blitz. They are going to drop to the number three side of the formation, so the number three receiver is the inside most receiver on the trip side. A hard flat is responsible for protecting the short outside area of the field. These are called the flats. They do not drop for depth, and the pro tip is that if you were to playmaker or shade your coverage down, it's going to turn basically any zone on the outside into a hard flat. And these are going to take away smokes, hitches, flat routes. Opposite of that would be a cloud flat. These are used by the outside corners in a cover two and are responsible for protecting outside deep and short areas of the field. Their primary option is to go deep and then rally to the short throw. Notice here how the corner was taken away. They would respond to the hitch after that if they checked down. A soft squat is found in cover two blitzes. They may play man to man down the sideline if there is no outbreaking route by an inside receiver. So notice here how they are trying to trap the out cut. We throw the out route, but the player in the soft squat jumps the route. A curl flat is found primarily in cover three and is used by the outside edge player. Its priority is protect deep outside and then rally to the short outside. Note here how the curl flat is protecting deep to the outside and then rallies to the throw underneath. A quarter flat is kind of like a curl flat, but it's found in a cover four defense. Again, used by the edge players, and it will carry seams to a certain point. Watch how it drops down the seam with the Y receiver before stopping and trading him off to the deep zones. However, it will also match an out route if it breaks shorter than that corner route on the previous play. Watch how that same receiver is going to run an out cut and he matches the route to the sideline. And last but not least is the seam flat. These are found in cover three fire blitzes. They can match certain out routes by an inside receiver and will sometimes convert to man to man versus an inside seam. Again, these are found in blitzes, so you're gonna try to get home to the quarterback before this zone is really responsible for doing a whole lot.